Hey, let me in. Let me in. You let me in. What is this place? Oh, this path leads to Mount Fort. No entry is permitted. Why not? Uh, tell me about Coco. I need to talk with Coco. Um, can't let you in, but you can meet him outside the fort. He goes into the forest every night, to the west, not far from here. Nobody needs the mountain fort anymore. We all have to make a living somehow. Okay, bye. West of here. Okay, well that's good. Hey, we made progress. Over to the west, not far from here? I feel like I'm far from there. No, I don't know. Let's just patrol the area. He can't get past us. I mean, he can. We don't really know what we're doing, do we? I wonder if we can catch him walking. That would be nice. Oh, oh, <gasps> hey, hey, you look like you might be, you are Cole Cole. Hey, dude, I have a question for you about a necklace. What can you tell me about a necklace? Hey, I heard that your master, the Lord Commander, recently bought a necklace. I'll pay you well if you bring it to me. My master wouldn't buy something as useless as a necklace. But the young master, the son of Lord Commander, he might. But he left a couple of years ago. Seems that I'll never find that necklace. Rats! Well, I don't know what to do with that information, but... I mean, that's not nothing, right? Of course, right. Welcome back, fellow keepers. Welcome back to the graveyard shift. <laughs> Sorry, I was gonna just promise not to make jokes like that again, but I cannot make such promises because I'm not a liar, usually. Hold on. Fellow keepers, I don't know if I've done the sermon yet. Do we need to do that really fast? Have we sermonized yet? I don't think we've sermonized yet. <gasps> We're running out of time. Are you kidding me? Am I so disrespectful of my own flock that I cannot remember if I've given them a prayer or not? Have I led the sermon? I don't know. What do we need to lead the sermon? I don't know. What is this? Wait, maybe I did already do the sermon. I probably asked for money, didn't I? <laughs> that seems like me. Well, because I cannot recall if we have done our sermon yet. Uh, let's just go pray really fast. Really fast, really fast. Lickety splickety. Okay, flock, flock, flock. Do you need? Oh, phew. Okay. Well, that makes me feel a little bit better. Okay. Anything else? Well, I just wasted the afternoon trying to get that all taken care of. Okay. So let's go ahead and empty our pockets. And then we're going to be up to something up to some thing what are we up to don't ask questions uh i'm sorry i'm being kind of rude you're allowed to ask questions but just don't ask what i'm going to do because that is a mystery for even me to find out what was i doing with this body <laughs> yes let's extract and while i extract allow me to monologue really fast because guess what Hello, keepers. I'm a fool. And I know that that doesn't come so much as a surprise as you might think it would, but I am admittedly a fool. And I will tell you why, because I've been having the darndest time trying to figure out how to access the journal, the old keeper's journal, uh, which is located in this dungeon right over here. And you see, I was a little hesitant because I have died at this point. Look, those are my bones. Those are my very bones. And so I didn't really want to cross the threshold for fear of meeting a similar fate. I've died twice already. So, you know, I don't, I'm not really eager to do it again. However, a little ghoulie told me that all I really have to do is walk around the edge like so. I cannot believe I didn't think to do that. I thought I had to go all the way down to the bottom of the dungeon, but no, I just had to sidestep a little, wiggle my way around my own bones, and voila, here it is. Okay, so we've got the peeper, the peepers. <laughs> I mean, do keep your peepers peeped, I guess, but we've got the keeper's journal, which means now we must 
uh, wait for moon day to give it to the astrologer. So that is something that we've got to look forward to in the future. But in the meantime, what are we going to do? I'm so glad you asked. I want to burn a body. You know, every now and then you have that little tickling urge to just burn a body. I've got that. Glad you know what I'm talking about. So let's take this here body. Oh man, I'm making a lot of mistakes. Disappointing. Okay, let's uh, take this body in the middle of the night and take it to our uh, burn pile. I can never remember what these things are called. What are they called? Uh, yeah, oh, you know, the place for burning corpses. <laughs> a fireplace. A place for fire. I don't know. A, um, you know what? I don't want to hurt myself trying to think about what that could be called. So we're just going to let it be. Instead, we're going to get some wood billet. Join me now, won't you, while we get this wood billet. I am 100% positive that is how you say that word. Craft, craft, craft. Okay, back we go. I should probably store a lot of them and put them in a trunk over here so I don't have to do this again. Okay, here we go. Let's build... A thingamabob. A place for burning corpses. A crematorium, that's what they're called. Oh my gosh. I think one shall suffice for the time. No. Let's go ahead and make a cup. Well, that will block off our lovely little trunk. Uh, okay, that's all we can do at the time being. Two should be good. We'll have one for right now. And we'll have one for later. I am always... <laughs> I'm always wanting to burn a good body, so it's good to have a spare. Okay, let's light this sucker up. Oh, 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 burn, baby, burn. Burn, baby, burn. Ah, what a lovely night for a fire, don't you think? I think so. And I'm very excited for the spoils that we will get. <laughs> Give it here, Malfoy. Okay. I am a little impatient, which is funny, because I don't really think we have that much going on. Oh, we got a burial certificate. All well and good. Okay, so what are we up to? I'm so glad you asked. We've got so many tasks. Exhibit, uh, there's an exhibit somewhere. No NPCs. That's where we want to go. So we need to get the astrologer, the old keeper's diary. Check. We need to make 10 silver star wine for the gars, for the inquisitor. X out, X out. I'm not helping the Inquisitor anymore. Last time I actively helped him burn a witch and I am still feeling very guilty over that. So we're not gonna help the Inquisitor anymore. Snake, we need the Necronomicon. We need to get the merchant a cure for his curse. We need to get Miss Charm a vial of perfume, which means we need frogs. That sounds like a good time for me. I like frogs. Coco told us about somebody we need to talk to, right? Oh me, oh my, I do not recall. But in any case, let's go ahead and make our merry little way to the dead horse. Let's go. Oh, hello. <laughs> For some reason, I always think it's going to put me outside the dead horse. Um, let's talk to her. Miss Chain, Miss Chain, you better talk with my husband. He's in charge here. You need 12 frogs. Consider it done. Eventually. Oh, Miss Charm is here too. Miss Charm. Hello, beautiful lady. Um, no perfume for you today. Sorry. Bye-bye. Um, what is the story with this cat? I want to pet that cat. His name is Cosmic Creepers. Hi, Cosmic Creepers. Hi, Wagner. Uh, bye, Wagner. No need to talk to you today. Hi, cat. Arr, bad luck. Not today. Uh, nor the other day I talked to you. You have a long string of bad luck. Hi, Haradric, what's up? Let's trade. Oh, burial certificate. Give me some money. Okay, what have you got? I need things for health because I need to go back down into the dungeons. So that's expensive. But you know what? Beer would help me probably not be so scared of all of the spiders. Oh, fellow keepers, should we go down to the dungeons? 
dungeon? Do you want to see the dungeon? I don't want to, but maybe you want to see the dungeon. Okay, I think I've got enough money to get myself some health. Okay, let's get ourselves some wine. Let's get ourselves quite a bit of wine, because it's scary down there. Um, finish offer. Thank you so much, Hradric. Bye-bye now. I mean, sorry. Bye-bye, Hradric. Bye-bye. Oh, no. Bye-bye, everybody. I'm leaving for reals this time. Okay. Hi, fellers. Don't mind me. We need to get some moths and butterflies so that we can go fishing for frogs. Oh, no. Look at my energy bar. This is not good news for me. I get tired so quickly, but hopefully not so tired that I can't catch a frog or two. Twelve frogs is a lot. I am upset because I get the impression that she wants to use the frogs for um, making the perfume, not because she has an affinity for frogs. So I'm not sure my conscience will allow me to give 12 frogs to Ms. Chain, but apparently that's what I'm going to do. Oops, I forgot how to fish. Sorry, I forgot how to fish. I've forgotten how to fish. Okay, hold on. It's okay. We will do this together, fellow keepers. Except that my reflexes aren't very good. Keep your peepers peeped. Yes, I'm so close to the mic. This is my asthma. Oh, no way. Oh, second try. <laughs> okay, fishes. I mean, frogs is. Hi, frogs. Uh-oh, no bait. I've got no bait. It's a 0% chance with no bait. What's this? Something has an 80% chance with no bait. What could that be? Do we care? Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, well, there's something. Nary a frog, but here's a fish. Very a fish. Nary a frog, very a fish. <gasps> I should not have had that big of a cup of coffee, for I am out of control. Okay, let's go find some butterflies and moths. Let's see. I don't actually care about the flowers so much, so if we could get a couple of butterflies, that would be pretty neat. Thank you. That is all. Hi, woodsman. How's the weather today? Yeah, you know, it was raining the other day. Okay, see ya. Hi, boyfriend. How are you doing? I've got some flowers for you. How are you doing? Let's trade. You're welcome, fella. Oh, you actually do have something. Uh, no thank you. That is not at all what I would like. My love, you have to get me something else. Okay. Oh! 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 My boyfriend keeps butterflies! That is good to know. Okay, good deal, good deal. We'll be able to catch a couple of frogs for sure this way. <laughs> not enough energy. Oh no. Oh no, we're not going to be able to catch a couple of frogs after all. Rats. Okay. That's fine. Unperturbed. Let's go to sweet home. Home sweet home. And let's take a quick little nap. Okay, let's go to bed. Good night. Washy, 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 washy. Okay, rise and shine. Ah, oh, I'm so refreshed. Good. Me too. Let's go into the night and get some moths. Oh, look at all those flowers over there. Oh. Foolish me. I just needed to cross the river. Here we go. We're for sure going to get all the moths we need by the river. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I spoke too soon. I'm not finding a single... Okay, there's a single moth. Oh, we should fish here! What if there... There must be frogs here. Why would I have to go all the way into town to get some frogs? See? You don't have an answer either. So, let's just try here. Okay. Hmm. How are we doing? We've got 11. Oh, I haven't even been looking. So we've got 11, we've got 11 moths and six butterflies. So actually, I think we're doing okay. Potentially. Let's fish it here. Oh, couldn't ask for a better atmosphere. This is a fishing spot like others you can find in the village swamp. Okay. Oh, poo poo poo. But we don't know what all of these things 
car. That's not good. Oh, I am not very good at that, am I? No, no, no. Okay, keep your peepers peeped. Watch the dinghy. What is that? Watch the bummer. Oh. Okay. Oh, these waterfall fish are frisky. Frisky? No, they're just antsy or something. What is that? A pike? A sturgeon. Not at all what we want. Let's try again. I don't think that there are frogs here. <laughs> I don't think frogs would be out that deep, but that's okay. Let's see what we can find. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I cannot believe it. That is such a such a teeny tiny little detail. It's very difficult for me to <laughs> see that. Oh, my fishing rod is very particular. Very touchy. Okay, perch. Well, I regret to say that that is not a good place for frogs. So, let's go back to the dead horse. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I keep forgetting. I can go beyond the dead horse to the lighthouse, which is good news for me. The reason it matters? Give me your flowers. No time for gardens, time for frogs. Anyways, the reason why it matters is because we're going to have to go there very soon to deliver the diary. When? Oh, I don't know. What? Are my pockets full? Yikes. That is not at all what I was expecting. Shall we just eat some stuff? Yeah, let's eat them all. Eat them all. We don't need flowers. Voila. Yay. Okay, give me all your berries. Anyways, now we don't have to worry about passing out on our frog hunt. Oh, okay. Yes, I missed that. Okay, frogs. Calling all frogs. Frogs. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, good deal. This is very nice. I'm very much enjoying this. Though I do have to focus. Fishing does escape me a lot. I'm not good at fishing no matter what game I play. But you know what? If we're just hanging out here catching frogs, fellow keepers, we could just chat a little bit. Let me tell you what I've been doing. Well, I do find myself a little over energized. You see, I have been having lots of coffee in the afternoons, because how else are you supposed to make it to nighttime? <laughs> so I made myself a lovely caramel latte today for those interested parties. Name, I'm interested. Yeah, let me turn it on. Anyways, yeah, I made myself a lovely caramel latte today. Did I make the caramel? No, but it is homemade. So I don't want to falsely advertise and make it seem like I know how to make caramel, for I do not. So you can all be jealous of me. <laughs> That's fine. It is very good caramel. And I know I made it sound like it's a latte. It's just coffee with caramel milk. But because I don't have an espresso machine, that's as close as I'm going to be able to make or be able to get to homemade caramel latte. And you know what? It is tasty. I highly recommend everybody try to make their own homemade caramel latte. How many frogs is that? Seven frogs. We're over halfway there. And you know what? It doesn't take much of our energy bar. This is actually delightful. A wonderful way to pass the day. Okay, but now we must focus. So let's see, that's what I have going on this afternoon. Over caffeination. And you get to enjoy it. And if you, hey, what the heck are you? A gudgeon? Oh, I didn't realize I ran out of bait. You can use a gudgeon. That doesn't do much for us, does it? Well, it's good to know. That was a really funny sound I made. But since we are interested in... Shoot. I forgot. That was a waste of a moth. That's okay. Maybe we'll... We're not going to get anything. We're not going to get anything because that was a zero percenter. Okay. Not a zero percenter? Did I get a frog? I got a frog. What luck. Okay. Well, we're having a lucky day. 
I mean, so far. <laughs> Things are liable to change. Okay, frogs, calling all frogs. But yeah, you know, I was trying for a long time to cut down on my caffeine. <laughs> no. You've got to stop me next time, me. How could you do this to us? But yeah, I was trying for a while to cut down on the caffeine because I do drink too much. And it's probably not good for my health, but then there just came a time when I realized, why not enjoy life? Why not enjoy life? And if drinking a nice cup of coffee in the afternoon with a homemade syrup of some sort brings me joy, well then gosh darn it, I'm going to have another cup of coffee in the afternoons. And besides, I don't think that there's anything cozier than playing a cozy game with a cozy cup of coffee can you? I don't think so. In fact, I hope you're drinking coffee right now. And I would love to know what kind of coffee you're drinking. You can tell me if you feel like sharing. I love talking coffee. Oh, look at all these frogs. What time is it? It's not even hardly prong day. What, what, what are these days? I don't know, <laughs> but it's prong day. We should have prawns on prong day, don't you think? I think so. In any case, oh, 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 I'm getting slower. My reaction speed is getting slower, which is a little worse. I need to think with all of this caffeine raging through my blood, I'd be faster. That is not the case. That is a myth, a myth. Okay, here we go. We must be getting close now. I've just been raking in these frogs. We've got 15 frogs. That's 12 for Ms. Chain <laughs> and three for me. Why do I need frogs? Why does anybody need frogs? For friends. I am a big fan of frogs. Oh, sorry. I was talking about um, pulling up your guard and I hope you don't mind. Oh. Out of the way, everybody. My business is more important than your business. <laughs> Where is she? Hi, Ms. Chain. Who are you? Do I even know who you are? I don't know. Hi, Ms. Chain. What's up? I got you some frogs. You better talk with my husband. He's in charge here. No, I wish to talk with you. Here are some frogs. Hey, now that we're bestest of best friends, Ms. Chain, give me that perfume. Okay, sweet. So what's this? What do you have? Fish delicacies, tasty and healthy, sweet baking, mm -mm. pies. Oh, I like pies, so we'll get that. I also like sweet baking, so we will get that. Um, uh, you know what? I really want to get that too, but I am not going to because I cannot accept this offer. How come? How come you can't accept this offer? Get out of here then. What about this? Cannot accept this offer. Money's not good enough for you, Ms. Chain. Well, whatever, good. get out of here. Me, me get out of here. Bye, Ms. Chain. Wow, wow, I didn't like that exchange at all. In fact, I'm going to go take myself to town, get struck by lightning. That would be a far more pleasant experience than being told that my coin is no good. What was up with that? I'm stealing your berries. I hope you don't mind. In fact, I'm so angry. <laughs> I'm so angry. I'm going to steal your flowers too and leave them there. So you know that somebody committed vandalism and didn't even care enough to clean up the mess. Okay. Let's take our secret passageway home, home again, home again, jiggity jig. Where are we going? I don't know. You know what? Actually I do know. So hear me out, fellow keepers. We have to wait until moon day for um, a visit to the astrologer. We have to wait until Ms. Charm Day. I don't know what else to call it. Ms. Charm Day to give that perfume to Ms. Charm. So while we wait, let's go to the dungeons. I really want to show you these spiders so that you don't think that I'm making up how scary they are. Do I remember how to fight? <laughs> That's a really funny thing to ask me. Of course I don't remember how to fight. Okay, wow. Okay, okay, okay. See, we do remember. <laughs> I am a little nervous. I will tell you what. This, what the heck is that? That. 
Oh, blah, blah. It's got a mask on. Oh, I hate this. Blah. Blah. Am I supposed to run past you when you do that? Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we run. He reminds me of Hexus. A little bit. I like Hexus, though. He's really neat. I don't like whatever this is. Oh, what is that? Oh, I should have emptied my pockets. Hold on, let's eat some flowers. Yeah, I cannot believe that I uh, didn't think to empty my pockets before coming to the dungeons. What a dingus I am. I'll say it, I'm a dingus. Black jelly. Oh, I don't like that at all. It makes me think of... Like, I just killed No Face, and I don't like that at all. Oh, I could put stuff in there. I can't put stuff in there. Just kidding. Pretend I didn't say anything. Okay, well, I thought I was going to show you spiders, but... Oh, you guys suck. Get out of here. I own this town. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I will say I might struggle pretty significantly because I just do. But I've also been playing Hades, and Hades fighting style is just deeply ingrained into my brain at this point, so I don't know why I did that. I don't have any room in my pockets for anything, anything at all, just black jelly. Oh man, maybe I'll come back later. I don't think this stuff goes away. Yeah, you can just chill there. Bye. They're doing crossfire. Okay, gloopy gloops, you come here. Yes, slimes, calling all slimes. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, you slimes can come too. You're invited to the party. My fighting style is definitely just run in and see what happens. Oh, <gasps> not enough energy. Oh, 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 oh. Bad time for the screen to stop telling me what's happening. <laughs> Okay, hi. I'm here to slaughter you all. <laughs> I'm such a good fighter, I just don't even know what to do with myself. And yeah, 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 yeah. Dead, 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 dead. Okay, I don't like those guys at all, but I will say... <sighs> fire. Fire bats! They are a distinct improvement to the spiders. I think you'd all agree with me. Though it is a shame that you didn't get to experience that, because that was awful, and I'm very sad for myself that I had to deal with it. Get out of the way of this <laughs> bat. Myself. I am not a very good fighter. Is this gold? We'll never know. I don't have enough room in my pockets. Oh, do I need to go to bed? Bummer. I <gasps> Spider! Oh, see? Oh, rats, I have to go to bed. Otherwise, I would go fight that spider. Too bad, so sad. Let's go to bed. <laughs> I hate them. They spit web balls at you, and that is just an altogether unsavory experience. What I will say I enjoy is that all enemies slain here stay slain. And I like that, because then I don't have to worry about it, because I'm not a very good fighter. No worries, let's get out of here. Go to bed. Snake? What are you doing here? Hi, Snake. What's going on? All right, Snake, about that necklace. Bye. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think I had an update. Hi, zombie. Someday I'll find that key to let you out. Oh, I should come back with skulls. We only need five, and then we can have skulls in no column, skulls in a wall. Who doesn't want that? Should we do that really fast? Empty out our pockets just a smidge and see if we can stuff some skulls in there? I think I'm saving skulls for something else, but no matter. Let's pretend I'm not. What a fun game that is. Wait, no, this isn't where I keep my skulls. <laughs> where do I keep my skulls? Where would a reasonable person keep their skulls? Here? Yes, I only have three. Disappointed. Disappointed! That's okay. Maybe there's some skulls up yonder. <laughs> We're going on a skull hunt. First, a frog hunt. That was very successful. Then, a skull hunt. We shall see how successful that will be. Not successful whatsoever. That's okay. 
Okay, let's go. Man, seeing that urn reminded me I was working really hard to make sure I could get really nice headstones. Maybe I should do that too. Because we still have some time before we can go visit the astrologer. Also, I forgot we opened up this plot. We need to make sure we... I'm so excited I can't talk. We need to make sure we get some really good bodies. Don't you think? Wooden prayer station. I want that. The problem is I don't know how to make ink. I need... Okay, I will admit something, fellow keepers. I've been trying really hard not to look up tips just because I've wanted to experience things organically as they happen and be delighted and surprised when they do. But I'm not making good progress. And so I think the time has come for me to finally start looking up how to do things like get ink. But I feel like when I do things like that, because I did that with something else, I don't really remember what it was, but it turned out I couldn't do it anyways. Like the it wasn't the right time for me to do whatever it was. And so I kind of got into the habit of just having it be a waiting game. Let's put all of our friends in there. You can all go in there. These should go in the kitchen. I don't know what to do with you, so you get to go in there for funsies. <laughs> I hate that I do this, but I'm doing it. We should investigate black jelly, actually. Um, we need to get more seeds, too, because we need... Oh, more carrots. Let's deliver some carrots. Should we grow some more things? Yeah, obviously, because we're farmers now. You can go right here. Dunzo. And as a matter of fact, a dunzo. <laughs> good, good, good. I see some berries that we need to get. We also need to check our honey traps. Okay, perhaps honey traps is not the right word. Our, our, our bees, our beehives, because we've got some nice, oh, I need to go to bed. Oh. I don't have time to sleep. I've got things to do, and I don't think you understand and appreciate how busy I am. Me? Oh well. Good night, fellow keepers. Washu, 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 washu. Okay, fellow keepers. Whoosh, refresh, refresh. Let's go deliver those carrots. Oh, it's raining. That is actually very atmospheric. I actually quite like it. This is the vibe, fellow keepers. A rainy day. Where am I going? Up here. <laughs> Let's put in some carrots. Ding a ling a ling, Miss Donkey. Uh, my friend, come deliver me a nice, good, fresh body. I am a little concerned that there will be bats. What did I say? Come dive bomb me. <laughs> I missed all of those swings. That's okay. Don't you bother me, bat. I'm just getting honey as I am wont to do. Voila. And let's get some berries while we're here. Okay, I will come to that side if that is what you want. Any, yes, honey from my sweet, sweet bees? Thank you, bees. I need to make another one. I want to be a beekeeper. I think, look at all those bats. I... <laughs> You guys are cute from a distance. I will give you that. We need 10 bees. Everything else is totally manageable, except for the bees. Not the bees. Come here, like stand still so that I can get you, please. That was a very um, kind bat to let me do that. Oh, good golly. Honey is a wonderful thing, okay. While I'm up here, I might as well just grab all this stuff. I have been very busy, apparently. Oh, come along, come along. Oopsie poopsie. <laughs> I literally never say oopsie poopsie until I sit down to record. What is this? What is it about recording? Maybe it's just the mindless chatter. The mindless chatter of somebody doing menial tasks like hauling and kicking logs from one place to another. I happily am not gonna have to worry about wood for a long time. What am I gonna have to worry about for a long time? How are my crops doing really well? Good job, team. And what do we do while we wait? Should we get a headstone ready for the new visitor when, whenever we get one? Probably need to be here, right? Ceramic bowls? No, where do you get urns? Where do you make urns here? Yes, I think so. Oh yeah, 
Perfect, perfect. So we have three, we need eight more. What's that, clay? Where does one get that? I think there's clay deposits over here. Come on, fellow keepers to the potential clay place. Clay deposit, maybe, I don't know. There's a hole over here in any case. Let's see what it gives us. Hopefully our pockets are empty, but who knows? It's me. Oh, it is clay. Good, a clay deposit. So, oh, and we forgot to investigate the black jelly. Because I want to know what that's about. I bet we can cook it into something. Oh, we need to cook our fish. Oh my gosh. We actually have a lot to do. And we're going to have to go to sleep again soon. Okay, that's enough. That's 13 chunks of clay. So here's what we do. We get that started. Actually, I don't think this is the thing where we can just leave it to do its own stuff. We're gonna need to sleep. Oh, rats. That's okay. Okay, <laughs> come on keepers, back to bed. Oh, that was a lot of work. We need our sleep. Good night. Wash, 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 wash. Okay, up and at him, fellow keepers. We've got a lot to do. We're probably gonna... Oh, wow, fog. Lovely. This is also a mood, I will say. Okay, so let's finish this really fast, and then we will... What's wrong? Oh, are we done? <laughs> Nothing's wrong. Nothing's wrong. Let's go put some stuff in random chests, because I don't know how things are organized. Of course I don't know how things are organized. Why would I know how things are organized? What a silly thing to assume. Me know where things are on my own workyard? That is a very funny assumption that you're making about me. Okay, let's put that away. Good, good, good. Oh, let's go get some fish cooking too. Wait, let's finish. Let's not be too hasty. Yeah, body! Thank you. You are awesome. My donkey friend. Am I distracted? Yes. <laughs> I want to go get that body, but we must get the fish starting first. We simply must just get things that can work on their own time. Oh, I want to make lasagna. We can do that. But for the time being, let's bake some fish. Oh, and that makes us a good fisherman. We could make fish soup. We can make fish soup right now. Oh, oh, oh. fish soup. Okay, change of plans. That's what we're doing. Change of other plans. Oh, it's raining again. I love it. I love it. It's very moody. It's very cool. I like it a lot. Okay. Perfect weather for <laughs> figuring out what to do with this body. I do want its skull. I'm saving up skulls. Oh, it's not a very good body at all. You're going to really ruin my yard does it. You're excluded. You're not allowed in my graveyard. We're going to burn you. The audacity. The actual nerve thinking that you could come into my graveyard. Not allowed. Uh, so we're just going to burn this baby. Burn. I mean, it is always a little upsetting to get rid of this good stuff. We need this stuff. For what? Well, fat, I think, can be used to make candles. I did not collect that, so that means it went wrong. Oh no, that means my pockets are full, obviously. Oh, and while we're down here, we're gonna investigate our black jelly. Of course. <sighs> There's just so much to do. I don't even know what I need all this stuff for. Mm. Okay, we're gonna, in okay, okay, okay. Here's the new plan. Oh, poop, that didn't work, did it? Rats. Okay, so we're running out of energy again. Goodbye, all of you. So, okay, here's the thing. We are gonna leave some body parts on the floor. That's fine. Don't even worry about it. I, I'm not worried about it. Why are you worried about it? I'm not worried about it whatsoever. But what I am worried about is um, not knowing what this black jelly is all about. Tell me more about this black jelly. Let's work it out. Good, it can be decomposed into fluid and essence. Neat. No time to think of anything. We have to burn the body. Eat some berries, yum, 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 yum. Eat the berries. Uh, take body, burn body. 
Bye, Jerry. You would approve of what I'm doing. Here we go. He has not finished all of his carrots. There we go. Perfect. Burn, burn. I guess we could go now. No reason to go right now, I don't think. Do you think? I don't think so. We need to wait for the astrologer to arrive anyway, so we might as well enjoy a good bonfire. I'm enjoying it immensely. Hey, the rain stopped. I didn't even notice that. Okay. You all can stay there too, I guess. I'm too busy to empty my pockets. So we're going to go teleport to the lighthouse and deliver the journal. This has been a long time in the making. Hi, astrologer. Ah, guess what I have? Here's a diary. Oh, great, great. How many important things that must be in this book? Amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you for the story. Oh, I haven't felt so alive for a long time. <laughs> so, uh, how can I open the portal on Witch Hill? Just stop reminiscing. Let me see, you need to craft a spirit laser. But I don't know what a laser is, sorry. What? It should be crafted on the pedestal in front of the portal. Hmm. You need to craft it in two parts, an emitter and a barrel. And here we have three parts of the emitter. Here, a mirror of pride, an eternal burning coal, and a salty fork. I don't want my forks any other way. <laughs> Okay, that does not bode well for me. What about the second part? The second part of the book's text is covered with something sticky. I'll need to clean it off first. I think I need some acid and restoration tools to clean it. Roger, Roger. I don't know how to do that, but we'll figure it out. Where can I find the stuff? He wrote that his friends believed that all these things could be found in the town. I don't understand this, but he wrote that they were the soul of the town. Well, I can't get to the town. It all sounds like a delusion to me. Magic. Ah, what nonsense. Agreed. If I were you, I'd start with something you can see. First, I check the pedestal near the portal. Second, try to get to the town and find those items. I've tried... Ooh, I know how to make acid. That's dangerous. So about that acid, do you know where I can find any acid? I gave up alchemy many years ago. It's really a dead-end occupation. But I think I know where you can get some acid. There should be an old woman in the swamp. She's definitely crazy. But in the distant past, she sold chemical ingredients. Oh, that's good to know. Hey, about those restoration tools. Do you know where I can find some restoration tools? There we may have a problem, young man. The Inquisition destroyed them all. Fools! They believe that past can only bring harm and curses. Yeah, they are kind of uh, out of control. But I think you might still be able to find some on the black market. Somebody with criminal connections could help you. I know just the person my best friend, Snake. I definitely know the right guy. I should talk to Snake. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, no! We can only get the Necronomicon when we're level 40. Uh-oh. So... Okay. Bye. I have nothing more to say to you. Goodbye. I do want these apples, though. Okay, so... Problem, problem. <laughs> problem, my pockets are full. This is preposterous. Oh, I should... Okay, we'll come back... We'll... <laughs> I'm all over the place. Let's go home. Drop off my bees. Drop off my meat. Get my fish soup. Where's the bees? Oh, hey, we can... No, pick up the bees. Sorry. Sorry, this is just how it's going to be. All over the place. It's going to be all over the place. I don't know how to use that. I need to look up how to use that. Our story today has us going every which way possible. And you know what? That's just how it's going to be. That's just how it's going to be. What are all these ceramic jugs doing in here? Why are all of these ceramic jugs in here? Hmm. Oh, so you can make funeral urns. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, let's get something else cooking. Let's do that. Get rid of a fish. Okay. What did I say we were going to do next? Fellow keepers, what were we going to do next? Okay. Focus. Okay. We're focused now. 
we're doing what we said we were going to do. It's not going back over and trying to figure out what to do with the ceramic urns. It's going up here to look at the thing we have to look at that I said we were going to look at. Oh, hello, fellow guardsmen. Hey, stop sneaking around. You've been warned. I'm just walking around. Don't mind me. There's nothing to see here. Oh, there's something to see. Then what are you doing here? It's an ambush. It's an ambush. Um, I'm not an expert, but it doesn't look like an ambush to me. Inquisitor had a bad dream about this portal and the cultists. This portal? So now we're waiting here for the cultists. What cultists? Hmm, bad cultists. They're definitely connected with witches. Help me out here, Tom. <laughs> yeah, come on, Tom. They're witch cultist idiots. Oh, they want to do something. I paused too long. If they win, they'll put an end to the Great Inquisition. Sounds good to me. Yeah, and we'll lose our jobs. Come work with me on the farm. Maybe you're a cultist. Me? No, 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 no. I'm the graveyard keeper, and I'm also leaving. <laughs> can't check the pedestal while they're here. Get rid of the Inquisition guards at which hill? Which hill, you ask? This hill, this very hill. Okay, bye guys. Okay. <laughs> Rats. New task. Figure out how to get them away from there. We could make them really drunk. That's what the Inquisitor wanted us to do anyways. We'll have to figure out how to do that. We'll have to figure out how to do that, won't we? Yes, 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 yes. Let's look at our technologies because we learned a new technology. How to do acid. Anatomy and alchemy. Am I not going to see where to do that in here? Oh, a printing press. I want to make a printing press just because. Blueprint, fine trellis, create grapes, create hops. I don't know how to create grapes. I need grape seed. <gasps> and then I can make a wine barrel. Mm. All of this is very handy. Hmm. I don't know what I'm saving up for. Probably something very important that I no longer remember how to do. That's okay. Let's keep moving. Okay, so we need to go back and figure out how to make acid. I don't know how to do that. Oh, the bees. What else do we need to make bee stuff? Flitch? Is that what it's called? Flitch? I think it might have been flitch. Let's make some more flitch really fast. Just in case. Just in case. Yeah, so let's go see what's going on with the bees. Oh no, we're gonna have to do another sermon. Well, considering how we didn't do a sermon yet, that's actually not that devastating of news. Okay, no worries. Here we go. And as we go, let's think about what we want to do. We need to do something and some other things. Ta-da, I figured it out. Okay, we need to figure out, oh, nails. I cannot believe I forgot to nails. Okay, so we need six nails. While we're up here, come on, come on. Come on, everybody, come with me. You know what? That will take too long. I am very busy because I have a sneaky suspicion I'm going to have to sleep before our sermon. So I need six nails. I also need to look and see what acid will require. What else? Hmm. Another body. Okay. It is not my fault that I can't stay focused and do a single task when there's so much happening to me, I think you will understand my plight because now there's a body and we have to make nails. <laughs> I don't know where to make nails. Oh, here, I think actually, maybe I do know how to make it up. Okay, we'll do this really fast. 12 nails, that was really fast. Okay, so. This is what we're going to do. We're going to go check out our body. And then we're going to hopefully bury it. Oops. Hi, Jerry. Bye, Jerry. Just checking out this sweet, sweet body. Seeing what all we can do with it. If it's a good body, it's going straight in the ground. It's a good enough body. Come on, body. I do want that skull. We're just going to, you know what? That's fine. 
uh, do we go this way? Yeah, let's go this way. We're gonna take this body. We're gonna bury it. It's going to make everything look good. Oh, um, while we're here, excuse me, Daryl. His name is Daryl. We need to figure out how to make acid. Uh oh, how does one make acid? Okay, that's probably gonna. Oh, whoa, toxic powder, toxic extract, and chaos solution. We know how to make a chaos solution. Oh, ho, ho. So we need toxic powder. I don't know how to make toxic powder, unfortunately. Okay, come on, Daryl. So that's a potential problem. I'll have to look at all of my powders. Oh, money. Your prayers are answered. I'll come get that later. My, oh, I need to empty my pockets. This is very upsetting. There you go, Daryl. Hold on. I'm going to give you a nice place to live. Let's dig a little gravesite for our friend. Where do you think Daryl would like to go? I want to put it all the way over there, but you want to know something? This area isn't full yet, so let's put him here. Also, I don't think he'd want to be alone. Come on, my friend. Gosh, Daryl, we haven't known each other for very long, but I feel like you're family. I'm going to do a really good job for you. Here you go. Voila. Cover that up. I'm going to... I don't have room in my pockets for you. <laughs> oh no. Uh, yeah, you can go in there, 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 you can go in there. And you know what? As a matter of fact, you can go in there. Now what do I want? Oh, sure. I'll just put you around there for the time being. Okay, Daryl, let's give you a nice grave fence. This is not permanent. It's just for right now. Because I do want to build you a better thing. Okay, um, yeah, let's go. I know I was, we need to make bee stuff. We have bee business now. Gosh, so much business happening. So we've got bee business, but um, we're gonna wait on that for just a moment because we have to worry about our sermon. We're gonna get that taken care of, get all ready for that. I will take that. Should we do money or crops? What do you think? Let's do shoot, mm, commercial blessing. I think I want to do donations because I might end up having to buy some things. Let's go sermonize a smidge. Oh, it's too early. Nobody will be here yet. What's the point of having a sermon if people are not here? Hi, Bishop. I still don't have the fillets you are asking for. Mm, bye. What a bummer. Did you see our new addition? He's very nice. We'll have to do a much better headstone and yard. But for the time being, it's actually okay. Okay, that's it. I'm done waiting. <laughs> if anybody misses my sermon, that is their fault. Okay, let's pray. Let's talk about money because I'm always lacking in funds. Hear ye, hear ye. Everybody come sit down because I'd like to say a few words. Our church is great. Yeah, yeah, nice. Woo, nice. And now let us pray for this blessing. Okay, 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 okay. Nice, 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 nice. Your donations are welcome and demanded. Great sermon, great sermon, great sermon, great sermon, great sermon. Yeah, wahoo, wahoo, wahoo. Here's the money, 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 money. Thanks, guys. I appreciate your funds. In fact, I should probably use some of the funds to make this bench area a little better. I know, I think I need to go buy some silk. But for the time being, yeah, soft church bench. Two things of silk. A stained glass window. Wait, I want to know how to do that. We need to know how to make gold. We need to know how to make gold. Well, oh, grave monuments. Forget everything I just said. That's what I want. I want a grim reaper in my graveyard. Okay, we're just saving up. Oh, 
Do I remember what I was about to do before I got distracted? Of course not. Of course I don't remember anything. Okay, let's empty our pockets and we're going to do B business. We've got B business we need to attend to. I swear, I swear, I swear at some point in time, we will do things that we're supposed to do. Eventually, let's make a beehive so that they're friends. Voila, I want to make a trunk here. <laughs> Can I please do that? Okay, build, build, build. This will be good for us. Plenty of honey. Oh, I think actually the honey is ready. <gasps> wow, 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 wow. Okay. So we probably need to talk to Snake again. He's there on green days. We need to talk to Snake about those restoration tools. We need to talk to Clotho about acid, maybe? So we'll talk to her. What else do we want to do while we wait for Ms. Charm? Um, I think that's it. Well, we want to make Daryl a nice headstone, I think. So we can work on that. Sounds like a good plan to me. While we're over here, should we just go to Clotho? The nice thing is Clotho is actually quite close by. Oh, and I guess we should bring back some of this wood. Wood that I would. Ha 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 ha. Anyways, that wasn't even funny. Hey, Clotho, what's going on? I don't know how to make a health potion. Rats. So we need to get her a cauldron and we need to get her a health potion. Okay. I think we can buy a cauldron from Kresval, I think. Hmm. I guess we should go talk to some folks. See if we can buy some things. I mean, why not? We're waiting for Ms. Charm anyway. So let's go to town really fast. Let's go to the dead horse. Oh, I was going to bring that wood, but doesn't matter. Off we go. Don't trap me. Don't trap me. Okay, let's see if Creswallet is still open. I should have talked to the merchant when he's still there. Maybe he would have had a pumpkin. Okay, I almost went to town again. <laughs> that would have been bad. Hey, Creswallet. What's going on? I might want to trade from you. Oh, no. Well, I don't want any of these things, Creswallet. I make them myself, Creswallet. I think I have something that encourages trades, don't I? I think I do. I think I do. Why else did I want to come to town? Oh, let's go to the farmer really fast. The village is safe. Wahoo. From whom, though? Because it's not safe from me. I'm a menace to society. Hi, farmer. Uh, do you have a silver tear pumpkin by any chance? Um, I mean, you have a regular pumpkin. That's no good. That's no good. Should we get some seeds from him while we're here? Do you think? Probably some carrot seeds. And what else do we want to do? We need to make fertilizer at some point. Onion seeds, lentil seeds, pumpkin. I love pumpkin. You know what, for the time being, bye-bye. Bye-bye. I will come back eventually, but not right now, because I have some thinking I need to do. I need to really think about how I'm going to fulfill the merchant's obligations, because he wants me to bring him good quality vegetables. I don't have that. I need to make fertilizer. I don't know how to make fertilizer. See, fellow keepers, this is why I need to start looking things up because I'm just relying on discovering things naturally, but that's taking a long time. Time is a fickle thing. I don't feel like I have enough of it. Let's go over here and see what we can do. We want to make a really cool gravestone for Daryl. Oh, wow. I don't know how to do this. <laughs> I like it. I just don't know how to do it. Okay, so if we want to do something really neat, we need to have, what is this? Polished brick of stone, carved piece of stone, and complex iron parts. Okay, well, how do we make polish? <gasps> Why don't I have that tool? That's surprising. That's very surprising. Why don't I have that tool available to me?
what's wrong with my chisel? Do you need a specific type of chisel? Is that the problem? Do we have a problem here? I think we do. What kind of chisel did you need? An iron chisel. Okay, I have an iron chisel. Oh, that's a steel chisel. Steel will not do. Okay, well, at least we solved that mystery. For whatever reason, we can't use a steel, even though steel is better. Whatever, Ms. Charm, can you console me, please? Hi, Ms. Charm, guess what I have? I have some perfume for you. Here you go, a vial of perfume. Oh, let me kiss you. I'm so happy. <laughs> Ta-da. I don't want a story. I'll wear it to my concert at the Royal Palace. Finally, I will reach the pinnacle of my career. Oh, that's good for you. So many things still to remain to be prepared. By my sins, you are so sweet to me. Maybe you can help me a little more. I need a romantic story for the opening of the concert. Maybe you'll think of something. I'm a bad writer myself, and I don't want something trivial. Hmm, I think I know where I can get a good story for you. Oh, you're the kind of man I could fall in love with. <laughs> yeah, hold that thought. Hold that giggle. Leave me alone. I have my own one true love. Goodbye. Okay, we need a gold tier story. Oh, ho, 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 Wagner. Uh, I need a story, but I need a gold tier story. Not that. She needs a gold tier story, right? Hmm. Hmm. What if we get him gold tier wine? Do you think that's what would do it? Perplexing. What are we doing now? We had just had an epiphany. Oh, I remember we had an epiphany. Let's go home because I think we finished everything that we set out to do. So I think what we need to do now is figure out the chisel issue um, over here. So an iron chisel, we need two wooden sticks. Easy enough. Can we make wooden sticks here? Nope, not as easy as I was thinking. Oh my, where do we get wooden sticks? Okay, so we, <laughs> so we have to pick up wooden sticks. Is that true? Am I thinking correctly? We have to go pick up sticks. Okay, let's go get our carrots. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's beautiful. Give me my carrots, please. Okay, let's go. Can we make more? Yeah. You get started on that. Oh, I cannot believe it. Okay, so we've got a lot of care. We've got a lot of carrots. Wow. Okay, let's put you back in. I'm sure flowers can go in because they can go in. Do you like my reasoning? I do. Okay, we're gonna go do that. Let's plant some more because I think that will be a okay. Drop off the leftovers. Sounds good. And we're on task. We're staying on task. We're staying on task. Except I forgot what I wanted to do. Oh yeah, we need to go get sticks. So let's chop down some trees. It's awfully thick right here. Let's chop down this tree. Or gather mushrooms. That's also... Oh my gosh. No. <laughs> Did I... I got a wooden stick. Okay, out of the way. Oh no. Get a... Let's chop down this tree too. Why not? Why not? We're reckless. And we got our wooden sticks. And we'll just carry these guys back home. Okay, come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. That's far enough. Um, get on there. Okay, fine. That's also fine. <laughs> okay, so I have sticks. It's raining again. We knew it would. Okay, let's make an iron chisel. Because a, a parent, apparently... <laughs> Oh, do I have to go around the other way to make this even happen? Yes, that was the problem. Oh no, I'm tired again. Oh, I have no time to be tired. I'm extraordinarily busy. You don't understand. Well, I don't even have what I need because I need faith. That's okay. Okay, so we just needed one. Honestly, we have, we have to, okay. I will be able to rest easy. Okay, you're fine. You can go over there. I will be able to rest easy once Daryl has a gravestone. And then we will be able to rest, but not until then. Where am I going to do something? We need faith. That's what we need. Oh, 
my brain for shame. Phew. It's, you know what, it's been a pretty, pretty impressive day. We got a lot done. I'm still amazed that we managed to get the journal. I would not have been able to get that if left to my own devices. So I am ecstatic that some very clever little ghoulies told me what to do because I was just going to wait until I got to the bottom of that there dungeon. That would have been a really cruel disappointment. Wait, we need another one? Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That's fine. Everything is fine. I just have the memory of a sieve. My memory is a sieve. Oh, just enough. Just enough energy. It's okay. Come on to Daryl. Okay. Daryl, I have a cool thing for you. You will be outstanding. In fact, you're the only the second person to have such a grave. Isn't that amazing? Oh, the quality of our graveyard is 61. I think we're doing pretty good. All right, fellow keepers, I think that's gonna do it for this update. We got so much done. I feel like the past couple of episodes have just been mostly running around trying to figure out what to do, but I feel like we're finally on a good path. Honestly, I'm really pleased with how this is going. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this episode. Let me know if you did. And I think next time we're going to figure out what to do with those Trixie guards. We're going to get deeper in the dungeon. We're going to, oh, get a cauldron for Clotho. I forgot that's what we were going to do. Anyways, we're going to type a lot of loose ends, but for the time being, that's going to do it for me. Thank you all again so much for watching, and I hope to see you again next time.